What is up, YouTubers? It is Monday morning, a little bit chilly. At least the sun came out now. Waiting for a customer. <coughs> for a wash on the other side. And see what happens today. Driving along with a motor in a rainy day. Sold the washer this morning at Kenmore Washer. Guy said he had an older Maytag. I said, yeah, okay, I'll give you 30 bucks off for the old Maytag. I said, you sure it's an older Maytag? I only want older older washers. He swears it is. So I go look at it for $30, because he bought mine off for 350. Give him kind of a rebate. And <laughs> chart this out, guys. One of those. Um, I told him I'm going to do with this thing is scrap it. I won't give you anything for it. He said it works if the drum was flying all over the place. So you know what? Maybe I will fix it up. Says it works. He said it's really off balance. He said it flies everywhere and can't control it. Starts walking by itself. Of course, look at it. Maybe we can fix it. Who knows? We'll try to fix it. Who knows? All right. Shitty day, guys. Should be supposed to snow today. Something in this condition, I wouldn't pay anything for it. I said I'll take it for scrap metal. That's it. I don't even sell these kind of washers. But he says he was just. It works, it was just jumping all over the place. I mean, not jumping, like banging and walking itself all over the place. So, well, to take a chance at it, right, guys? Because I can tell you one thing, I sure got a lot of these control boards of these faces, complete. I got maybe like eight of them. So yeah, I wasn't gonna pay for this. This is definitely a lot of work. Oh my God, disgusting. She's disgusting, but it's a rainy day out. You know what I'm gonna be doing? Using that water out there to clean this washer. Okay, I'm gonna pop the cabinet off first thing. And see what's going on here. Let's pop this cabinet out and see what's going on here. All right, what do we need here? It is cold out today. I need two hands for this. Hands are frozen. off here let's get unclip that hose connect it to the back piece here we can see the drum the weights tilted down he said the spring just fell off as he was carrying it up in the basement so it's got more problems than just a suspension spring but I do have suspension springs too also good thing I kept them I'm gonna try to see if I can find a light here somewhere I know I have lights somewhere no, my big flashlight went. Definitely not in here. Got this light here. But is she gonna work or what? Okay, suspension spring right there. We'll attach that and see what's going on here. It's gonna be pretty, not gonna be easy to do this myself. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna get some gloves. Hang on, guys. You guys can see guys got some gloss big difference okay this is how you open these up you take the clips off the back here there's another clip there i just take the screws off let's take the screws off you pull your clip out just like that Put your clips there and basically you just bang it backwards some of them forward this could be forward probably yeah forward like that Hook. Something like that. Let me figure it out what's going on here. Piece of crap. It's released. Oh, I see. Okay, I pulled it too forward. A bit too back. Ah. Oh, what's 
to be playing games on me for. Hang on a sec. All right, I got it, guys. Just play around with it back and forth. You'll get it. I'm going to tilt the whole thing back. Hope they don't drop my headboard now since I got to take the screws off. Holy shit, man. Come on. You have to secure this. But anyways, you can get at it now. See your rods here? We'll straighten it out. We'll put the rod on it there. Replace the rods and see what's going on here. See, it's been banging so bad that it's just been banging all the chips. Plastic broken pieces. And this is a Maytag Centennial washer. All right, guys. Sorry, I couldn't film it because I needed two hands, but I got it in there. Not easy, so not much. What I did is I tilted, leaned it back a little bit on the bucket there. Get it out of my freaking way. So I leaned it back a bit. And I put it from the bottom up. Then I snapped the device grips. Was holding it for me. But I got her up. So let's tilt this back now and see what's going on here. It's a slit. Pain in the ass, these things are. All right. The rods are on. I see he's missing a spring here. See those springs there? Tension springs on the side. Those could be worn out too. I think he had an unbalanced load though. Is that rust? This might be a waste of time. But I got it on there. Something's definitely not going on here. We'll have to figure it out. So, I'm just going to check it. The springs aren't missing, though. Okay, she's up now. She's leaning that way a bit. You probably never even had it balanced properly. But this is going to be a lot of work to clean. My God. That's going to be sanded, repainted. So what's missing here? This one's on. I can't really see it because it's over here. Do I have this on right? I don't even think so. That looks more, oh I see. Yeah, I don't have it right on. I'm gonna have to turn that around a bit. But anyways, that's how it's done. Okay. That one's a bit wrong too, I think. All right, now, now I need two hands for this. All right, guys, pretty big difference now. Top nice and clean, sides. Did some scrubbing by hand. My hands are rotted and freezing cold scrubbing that. With the green wool pad, even did the top. I bet you can't see it now because she's sturdy now. It's not going to go anywhere. It's going to wash the top piece inside there. Do a touch up paint down there. But anyways, big difference now. Got to go install in here. I see some dirt still there. There you can see it. There you go. Makes take sensual. Going for sale surely or 350 bucks. Paid nothing for it. All right, guys. Guys, says she. Oh shit! What happened here? I see the knobs broken. Oh, it's not a pole. I keep forgetting. Holy shit! I don't know what it is. Push start. Start. All right. Well, we'll see. We'll give it a test tomorrow. Shitty day for that. I'm going home. It's freezing cold, wet, raining. But anyways, I'm done. Too cold.